we'd like to welcome you back to the Big Thirsty Show. I am the host that's with the most, that's going to give you that hot butter on your toast. And um, we'd like to say welcome y'all again. Now, first of all, we can't get away from the deal later. It's the hottest thing going uh, in the media, and we part of media, so we're going to give it to you, but we're going to try to be brief. But it's a lot to cover when, you, when you're dancing with the deal later. All right, so Kevin Lyle steps down from WMG Warner Music Group 24 hours after Didi's arrest, along with five other CEOs. CEO of uh, Sony Music Group, president of Warner uh, Music Japan. I mean, they're falling like dominoes. They, those freak off parties must have been something else for you to lose your job. You're the, you the, you the about to lose your job. All right, so the MDT, the Metropolitan Detention Center, has been dubbed hell on earth because of the horrific inhumane conditions and food, uh, frozen eggs and, and uh, frozen apples. And um, I mean, I mean, uh, oh, God, this, this hell on earth. So pray for the dealer later to survive that. He's in, he's in uh, suicide watch. And the MDT, and 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 we hoping for his survival. Uh, remember, Diddy is a son, a father, and a loved one, and he's innocent to um, proven guilty. So everything we say about the dealer later is allegedly, alleged this, alleged that. Read the disclaimer. Uh, yeah, 2018 news: a deceased porn star says that he was uh, allegedly a sex slave to uh, Diddy and Cassie. He was allegedly given herpes. And uh, he says that allegedly Rick Ross, DJ Khaled, all these macho, supposed to be rappers are gay, gay, gay. And if you want to be gay, 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 come on out the closet and quit infecting the, the, the straight population. That's all we got to say, say, say. Uh, Christina Karam is has been dubbed as uh, Didi's Gislaine Maxwell. She hasn't been arrested. She hasn't been charged. She hasn't been named in an indictment, but she's on pins and needles. Uh, Cassie's friend uh, Tiffany Red responds to criticism of her being a friend of Cassie and not doing anything while all the abuse was going on. Now, presently, right now, at the at the time of filming, she's live on Tisa Tales. Shout out to Tisa Tales um, YouTube. And uh, she's clapping back. She's talking about the foundations that they put in place to protect uh, people, the whole Me Too movement. And uh, go over there and check that interview out. Um... 50 Cent, Curtis Jackson, uh, second um, biggest line owner in Shreveport, Louisiana. He says that Diddy's troubles began to escalate with the whole breakup with the De Leon and Ciroc. So you, it was they, they were work. You can work for them, but when you're trying to own the company, hey, 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 you, you, hey, 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 we just gonna leave it at hey, hey, hey. But um, but it's no it's no coincidence. The correlation fits that uh, Cassie dropped that lawsuit. Uh, De Leon and Ciroc, them they used the lawsuit as an excuse to to not for him not to be the face of the company. Lawsuits, mud was slanged and countersuits, and civil cases became criminal cases. Hey, 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 this is the Big Thirsty Show, and everything I say is allegedly. And um, Kim Porter, Kim Porter's book has recently been taken off Amazon. It's been tearing up the internet. Now, I'm going I'm to uh, leave a little tag to a YouTuber. Shout out to that brother. Uh, who's who's got a copy of the book, the uh, audio copy that was read out loud for y'all that don't like to read. And this book is spicy, spicy, spicy. Too hot for YouTube. 
Oh man, some of the graphic details, oh my god. But uh, they speaking of murder plots, extortion, blackball, um, sex rituals, um, Tim Porter, um, she's naming names and claiming claims. Um, names like Will Smith, uh, Jada Smith, Snoop Dogg allegedly, uh, Tupac allegedly, Albert Shore allegedly, Kadada Jones allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. But that was a quick recap into the uh, Diddy later situation because we he can't dominate our news channel. We're about to get off into sports, y'all. So um, pray for the dealer later. Pray for his children. Pray for his mama. Because stress, cortisone levels, it's not good. And I'm big thirsty. And we're about to take it into a fun side of the program. All right, we got Yellow Boy, CEO of Shell Shock Records on the line. Hey, what's going on, Brother Babe? Hello, world. Hello, world. What's going on, Brother Thirsty? Hey, man, you little, little man, I'm not going to, I'm not going to ambush you. You live on the Big Thirsty Show, Ratchet Now. That's what's uh, happening. Yeah. So, look, listen, listen here. Uh, what we talking about today, we talking about Sean Puff Daddy Combs. Gotcha. And, um, you know, it's a lot, it's a, the, it's the hate train that people been on that train, and we don't know where where you at with 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 Sean P. Diddy, but right now where he's at, he's in solitary confinement on suicide watch in the uh, Metropolitan Detention Center, and it's been dubbed hell on earth. So um, we we want to know what you've been hearing, and and I know you ain't got no fear, but um, what have you been hearing about Sean P. Diddy Combs? Man, I'm hearing a lot of things, man, but I'm also <clears throat> going to keep it real because I'm one of the realest persons in the world. So <laughs> I got to keep it real with y'all on my feelings. I'm not a person to be listening, but I also know I ain't going to skip over some good and all this bad stuff, whatever. But I'm going to say this here about it. We're going to talk about him locked in or whatever. Man, I ain't a million now. I'm 100,000 now, 50,000 now, but I done been incarcerated before. And you and I know ain't no, ain't, ain't no feeling. But imagine if you almost, if you're a billionaire and you locked up Ooh. in a room, you ain't used to living like this. So I don't want to hear none of that. You know how he's feeling. Yes, he probably is going through it. Because I'll be going through it and you will too. So, <laughs> But you got to think, he on a whole nother living status. So yeah, he going through. And he don't know what's going on right now. But I'm going to say this too. A billionaire don't become a billionaire by itself. So look here. There's a lot of people going down like him. And I ain't the person that'll do this here, but you got people like Puff Daddy probably will do this. And you got to think, people doing this, some of the realest people in the world, they're talking about people that's dead to get out of jail. <laughs> so I'm going to keep it real again, my brother. And we're going to sum up like this here. And the world all going feel this here. If you got to do something to get out of your problem, they can say, you got, we got this on you. We got that on you. So look here, all we need you to do is tell us this, and we're going to let you go. So that's what I think is going to go down. I'm going to keep it real. <laughs> 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 and I'm out of there. I'm, I'm through with the whole situation. I hope y'all understood that. And I'd do it, and you would too. Like I said, because you got news down where I'm from, and my boy Thursday down there with one of the real of me, and we on the podcast, we talking, he real. Uh, Y'all already know who he is. He's from New Orleans. I ain't going to call no name. <laughs> so I ain't saying one of the real person where they like myself. But when I tell you, a billionaire don't become a billionaire by himself. So <laughs> with that being said, you know how the people come to their game. And you, if you're going to keep it real, you're going to take your time, you're going to do your own thing. You build like that, because I'm built like that. I'm going to take mine, if it's me. But I don't think Puff Daddy to build like that. <laughs> so, <laughs> what, 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 what really going to happen is, we got this on you. We got that on you. All we need from you is to tell us this. That's what I think going to happen. 
Yeah, <laughs> and I'm with it. <laughs> man, man. So listen here, brother Beige. We're gonna let you get back to your cowboy game. I know you're a true cowboy fan. You yeah, tell Jerry yeah. Jones to keep his head up and keep yeah. putting together that dream team. And I'm gonna let you get back, and we're gonna we're gonna yeah. give you the positivity and keep it keep you keep you up to date with the thirsty show. Peace yeah, and love, man. my brother. Peace and love, my brother. You know what? Right here, shock him out, baby. Yellow boy, CEO.